art and culture are at the heart of this city. And if you're looking to check out some new works, you should head over to the Ashe Cultural Arts Center. They have a great show going on right now. It's called The Art of the Black Experience, and it's all about showcasing black art and supporting black artists. They've got some phenomenal pieces. Let's check it out. <laughs> We are super excited here at the Ashe Cultural Arts Center to be in partnership with the Arts Council of New Orleans for the Art of the Black Experience exhibit. Asali Devon Ecclesiastes is the Chief Equity Officer for Ashe, and she knows that black artists haven't always received the support they need to thrive. The reason we're super excited is that this is an equity show. The Art of the Black Experience um, attempts to fix that history, and this is a show that is 90% black artists investing in our local culture bearers in a way that they deserve. My name is Nick Brer Aziz. I'm an artist in this exhibition. My piece is entitled When the Slaves Go Marching In, Charles Deslon. This piece is a part of my Rafter series, which explores the 1811 slave rebellion and the history of enslaved Africans being branded with the fleur de lis. What's really cool about this show is the variety of art forms. So you've got some photography. You've got this beautiful piece, which is wood on canvas. And then one of the most original ones I've seen, this piece is done on a screen window. My name is Kentree Sheck Snyder. My piece is called TD. She basically represents the, wom the women in our lives that took on motherly roles that were not actually our biological moms, but they still nurtured us, fed us, and took care of us uh, as if they were. She represents that, that woman that um, is a part of the village that it takes to raise a child. And if you want to snag one of these beautiful works, you'll have to head over to Ashe to see what's still available. The city purchased most of the art in this show to become part of a permanent collection in the city. And the art of the black experience will be at Ashe until January 28th. That's at 1712 Aretha Castle Haley Boulevard. The exhibit is actually part of an initiative for local funding to be spent on the arts. And the Arts Council of New Orleans will join us at 7 a.m. to tell us more about their percent for art program. Now, another one of Nick's pieces, one of the artists that you just saw, is part of the Sugar Exhibition at Antenna Gallery. That's at 3718 St. Claude until February 6th. And then Cantrice, the other artist in that piece, has a solo show for Black History Month titled We Grew Here. You can head over to her website, Ken, the number six studio.com for more information. And Eric, they had some phenomenal pieces in there. Yeah, I saw that. It looked really good. And you were saying what a great uh, uh, ex exhibit that is over at the at the Ashe uh, Cultural Center. It's a really good one. And the variety of art forms. You saw the one that was on the screen door? Yeah, Crazy. I, I did, like, did like that one. Very nice.